Hello, good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you today? Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello, how are you? I'm very tired. Good evening. Oh, really? Yes, I'm stressed. <laughs> All right, excellent. So, oh, I imagine, right? So, what about the rest? So, how was your day? Hello, hello. Very shy today, people. <laughs> Let's see here. Let's see here. We're going to we are going to wait for some um, minutes, like two minutes. Well, one more minute actually, and then we are going to uh, start with the class right here, mm -hmm. right? So. Good evening, everybody here. And Elizabeth, David, Erlene, Irma, Kevin, Maria, Marta, Mauricio, Nancy, Oscar, Humberto, William. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. All right. Good evening, teacher. No problem, Anna Elizabeth. No problem. All right. Thank you for being here on time. Right. So let's see here. else hello hello okay let's see hello hello people who joined the class right now Good evening, teacher. Hey, hello. Hello, hello. Let's see the rest. Okay. Okay, all right, excellent. So we are going to start right now with the class. So officially, officially, and again, good evening, everybody. So let me just start by asking us every day, you know, how was your day, all right? So some people say tired, some people say uh, good, all right? So, but we are going to see uh, that right now. Okay, so let me share the screen. So we're gonna start with the class tonight. Okay, so let's see. There you have it. All right. So can you see the screen, people? Yes. 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 Great. Excellent. Right. So everybody, um, we are going to start practicing, you know, to warp up right now. So with the pronunciation, all right, and to check final sounds and other details, we are going to do again a tone twister. Right. So take a look at this one right here. Do you see it? Yes? Yes. Okay, excellent. So let me repeat it for you first, so then you can repeat it in practice, right? Right. So let's see, for example, it says, wait one second. Okay. Let's see. All right. So, all right, everybody, it says, she sells seashells by the seashore. If she sells seashells by the seashore, where are the seashells she sells by the seashore? It's a tongue twister. I'm going to repeat it one more time slowly so you can catch the pronunciation. She sells seashells by the seashore. If 
She sells seashells by the seashore. Where are the seashells? She sells by the seashore. All right. You got it? Or you want me to repeat it one more time? One minute. Repeat it. Slower. Repeat. One more time. One more time. One more time. Yeah, one more time. No problem. No problem. No problem. Here I go. One more time. It says, she. Okay, let's do something. Let's do something. All right. So repeat it. Repeat it. You don't need to turn off the microphone. So you can be close to me if necessary, but repeat it. All right. So, Let's see. Um, let's do this one right here. Everybody, one more time here. So she sells seashells by the seashore. One more time. She sells seashells by the seashore. If she sells seashells by the seashore. Where are the seashells? She sells by the seashore. All right, excellent. Ready? Yes, yes, yes. Ready. Excellent. But when you people participate, you have to read it like this. She sells seashells by the seashore. If she sells seashells by the seashore, where are the she sells she sells by the seashore? Yes. <laughs> All right. So let's see, let's see. All right, practice, practice, practice. Let's see. Ah, uh, I saw my first volunteer. Irma is sleeping. All right. So let's see. All right. Oh, volunteers, volunteers, volunteers. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Who wants to try first? Hello, yo. All right, William. Yeah. Excellent. That's a good attitude, right? So, all right, tell me. She sells, she sells by the she's sure is she she sells she shells by the she's sure. Where are the she shell? She sells by the she sure. All right, excellent. Good job, right? So now let's just be careful with this word right here. Remember, this word right here, it says like C, like yes in Spanish, right? She, C, and then this one right here, shells. C, shells. She, shells. Ah, ah, ah. This is like if you have, for example, here, C, and then she, shells. Seashells. Sea Seashells. Repeat it. Seashells. Excellent. And this one is the same. So you go like this one. It's like C. And then C. Shore. Sure. Seashore. Repeat it. Seashore. Excellent. Okay. Try one more time. Repeat it, William. One more time. Okay. She sells. She see sell shells by the she saw she sure if she seals seals shells by the she saw she sure where are the she sell she seals by the she sure all right, excellent. Thank you very much, Giovanni. So you improved the pronunciation of those two words, right? Good job. Anansi, oh, sleeping, volunteer, volunteer. All right. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my God, Alexa, I'm sorry. You can go after Nancy, no problem. All right, go ahead, Nancy. Okay. She shares, she shares by the teacher. If she sells seashells by the seashore, where are the seashells? She, she sells by the seashore. All right, that was actually very good. 
Thank you, mm -hmm. Nancy. Good, good, good job. Good job. All right. So, hello, Alexa. Tell me. Hello, teacher. Okay. She shares. She she shares by the seashore. If she shares, she shares by the seashore. Where are the seashells? She she shares by the seashore. Amazing. That was actually super good, Alexa. Very good job. All right. Thank so that you. was fantastic. All right. So thank you. Let's see, Mauricio. Hello, Mauricio. Hello. Okay. Tell me. She shall. She shall be the seashore. Is she shall. She shall be the seashore. Where are the sea? <laughs> All right. Puedo ver, tengo levantado el emoji. Right. Okay. One more time. Go ahead. She shall, she shall be the seashore. Is she, she mm -hmm. shall, she shall be the seashore. Where are the seashell? She shall be the seashore. All right. Excellent. Thank you for trying. All right. So just remember it's not seashore, it's seashore. Okay. Excellent. Sure. Very good. So, uh, Carla Milena, and after that, David. All right. So, Carla, go ahead. Okay. She sells seashells by the seashore. If she sells seashells by the seashore, where are the seashells she sells by the seashore? Hey, super good and very fast. All right. So, that's actually good. All right. Thank you. Good job, Carla. Hello, David. Go ahead. Okay. She shall, she shall be the chisor. Is she shall, she shall buy the chisor. Where are the chisor? She shall be the chisor. All right. Excellent. Thank you very much. That was actually super good. Thank you. All right. Anybody else who wants to participate? You guys are doing good. Uh -huh. Any other volunteer? Apner, let's see. Uh, Irma, Kevin, Maria, David. <laughs> All right. Let's see who is here. Marta. Hello, Marta. Hello, teacher. So tell me, Marta, go ahead and participate, please. Okay. Mm -hmm. She says. She sells by the seashore. If she, she, she sells, she sells by the seashore. Where are the seashells? She sells by the seashore. All right, excellent. Thank you very much, Mark. That was actually super good. You were doing a good job. All right. Thank you, guys. So let's see. Uh, one more, please. One more and we finished. Who's going to be my next and last volunteer? Mm -hmm. Let's see, let's see. Cecilia, Sandra, Raul. Uh -huh. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Mr. Yeah, Eduardo. Yeah, How are you? Yeah, so, so. Oh, are you better now? Uh, a little bit. All right, excellent. So you want to participate? Uh, tell me. All right, can you read the town twister? Okay. <clears throat> she sells seashells by the seashore. If she sells seashells, hells. By the chisel horse, where are the chisel holes? The chisel by the chisel horse. All right, the C shorts. All right, thank you, Mr. Pardo. Really appreciate it. Thank you for being my volunteer. All right, and applause everybody who participated. You were doing a very good job. All right, so and let me just tell you, like, right, I motivate you to continue participating. All right, so entre más participen, you are going to improve more. Más van a mejorar y a quitarse el miedo y la pena, please. All right, so thank you, everybody. So now let's just go ahead and check some questions that we have right here. So let's see this one. 
One second. Okay, let's see here. It says this one. All right, everybody, please tell me if you see the new screen. Yes? Can you see a new screen? Yes, teacher. All right, excellent. So we have two questions there that we are going to uh, practice today to start with the class right here. But before, before you start with the class, with the question, sorry, I'm going to check attendance. So let's see here. Here it is, attendance, attendance. All right, it's loading. Oh my goodness. Internet connection issues. All right, don't worry. I will just do it later. Meanwhile, this is loaded. Let's continue with the questions. All right, so we have two questions right here. The first question says here, do you usually receive business guests in your workplace? Repeat everybody. Do you usually receive business guests in your workplace? Repeat it. Do you usually, do you usually receive play, business guests play, in, play, your, play, work in your workplace? workplace? Thank you. All right. Excellent. So do you understand the question? How would you translate it into Spanish? Uh -huh. Yay, yeah, exactly. Invitados, invitados. All right. So like that. Uh, in your in your business or in your company, um, do you receive guests? You know, when, when you're there, like, for example, maybe a supervisor or maybe maybe if you work for um, an international company, sometimes you receive uh, those type of visits. All right. So uh, or those guests in your company, for example, I remember uh, when I was working in a call center before. Uh, sometimes some American people visited the country. Yeah. All right. Oh, I'm sorry. Ah, is that is Maria? Aha, uh -huh, Maria. No problem. There you go. So let's see. In uh, you know, it's a very simple question that you need to answer. So it's a yes or no. All right. No, because my company is a national company or was a local company. Or you can say yes. Sometimes we receive guests from different countries or from a different city, for example, right? So let's see. Guys, who can give me an, uh, an example of the question number one, all right? So do you usually receive business guests in your workplace? Oh, by the way, I have a question for you. What is workplace? Workplace, workplace, this one. What is it? Lugar de trabajo. Exactly, super good. So volunteer for telling me an answer? Remember, it's a short answer. Mm -hmm. Hello. Come on, people, participate. Do you usually receive business guests in your workplace? Yes or no? I'm going to start asking. Uh, no. Sometimes uh, we receive uh, providers, people from Taiwan or China mm. people. Oh, interesting. And the, do they speak English? Yes, Taiwan people. The English is very good, and China's was also <laughs> China's. Repeat it. China. Exactly. China. Very good. Excellent. Yeah. Sometimes it's difficult to understand them, right? But hey, have yeah. have you ever talked to um, one of those guys? Yes, I have uh, some provider for China's China. China. Uh, but I talk with English within. All right, excellent. So you are practicing your English level with them. That's interesting. Thank yes. you, Maria. <laughs> okay, anybody else, people? Hello, hello, anybody yes. else? I open the door to the new business. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're saying that it opens door to new businesses. Is that what you said? Um, Mm, abre puertas a nuevos negocios oh. right that's true that's true all right good job thank you 
All right, let's just continue then with the question number two right here. It says, do you enjoy welcoming guests and why? Do you enjoy welcoming guests and why? So what's the meaning of welcoming guests, people? Mm -hmm. Any idea? Hello. Bienvenida. All right, exactly. Thank you, Irma. All right, so like, si disfrutas, dale esa bienvenida a los clientes. That's what he's asking, right? Do you enjoy that, people? Yes or no? Mm -hmm. No, or you don't like when the, co when the customers arrive or the guests arrive to the company. Hello? Aha, Carla. Mm, eating. Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. I enjoy. <laughs> I enjoy. All right. Excellent. And, and tell me, Carlita, what do you normally tell them? Repeat, please. <laughs> what do you tell them? What do you tell the customer when they arrive? How do you welcome welcome them? Um, welcome them, um, yes. I say good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Banco Bank. My name is Milena Lopez. Um, no sé cómo decirle en qué les puedo ayudar. Oh, no <laughs> problem. I will tell you right How now. can I help you? Exactly. How can I help you? Like this one. Very good. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ana Luisa, hello. Hello, Fisher. Tell me, do you enjoy welcoming guests? Eh, no sé si cuenta, pero bueno, yes. I, I ask um, human resources mm -hmm. in department in the time I indu induction the new uh, staff. All right. Yeah, you know, it, it counts, right? It counts, it counts. There you go. And uh, let's see this one. Thank you. That's actually super good. Um, now let's see this one. Who else? Who else? Oh, Nancy. Hello, Nancy. Tell me. Do you enjoy welcoming guests? I don't like. <laughs> so tell me why. Um, because um, in the in the branch in the in Salvador. Uh, no receive visitas. Guest. Eh, mm, visitas. Eh, más que todo en la, en la sede principal que es Colombia. <laughs> Entonces, oh, aquí no. <laughs> All right, excellent. And let me ask you a question, Nancy. So you work like in at the airport or in the office? No, in the office. Oh, office. I see. In the IT. Oh, and department IT. I see. Entonces, no, mm, I am, I am not in the airport. All right, interesting. So thank you, thank you for participating in this one. All right, so thank you everybody who participated. So now we are going to go to the next activity. All right, and for this one, people, let's just go ahead and use the uh, manual, right? So we can actually have it here, so we can see it. Oops. All right, so we're gonna go here quickly with the number one here. The, I'm sorry, the number two, because the number one is what we already did. All right, so we have a dialogue, so we are going to practice. And let's see what the instruction is. It says, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with the partner. Mrs. I'm sorry, Mrs. Tate arrived to a restaurant and she will train the personnel. Oh, let's see if you remember this word here. Do you remember this word? Personnel? Personal? El personal in a company, all right? So, train the personnel, Mr. Young, the owner, welcomes her, all right? How do you say this phrase into Spanish? Let's see if you understand it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Any idea? Mm 
Hello. How do you say in Spanish, Mr. John, the owner, welcomes her? Do you Welcome. know it or do you, or you don't know the vocabulary? Creo que es como a Mr. John, el propietario, ella le da la bienvenida. Eh, casi, pero sí, casi. Got idea. Right, Mr. John, el propietario, le da la bienvenida a ella. Ah. All right, excellent. Thank you. Estuvo cerquita, very close. All right, so that's it, that's it. All right, let's just start right now and let's just go with this one. Everybody, please pay attention to the pronunciation and then you are going to participate. It says right here, Hello, good morning. Are you Mr. Young? Yes, I am. I am Miss Tate. I am the trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you too, Mrs. Tate. Let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the branch manager and this is Leo. Welcome, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Super important here, people, take a look. We have this question right here, all right? So like this, what do you do? There we go. So what is the meaning of that question? Do you know it? ¿Qué haces? Mm, almost, you know. ¿Qué estás haciendo? No. ¿A qué te dedicas? That is correct. That's the correct translation for this one, all right? So, ¿a qué te dedicas? So, for example, let's see. If you ask me that question, all right? So, for example, let's see. Um, Mauricio, all right? Ask the question to me, please. What do you do? I am a teacher. Understand? Yes or no? Um, all right, so I'm talking yeah. about my job, what I do. For example, Anna. Hello, Anna. All right, what do you do? Uh, what do you do? I am uh, checking the information. All right. Financial. Okay, excellent. So if you pay attention, oh. people, when Mauricio oh. asks the question to me, I talk about my job. So I am a teacher. Yo soy un maestro. But Anna, when she gave me the information, she told me the activities that she was doing in her job. Estoy revisando la información, etc. Right? So you can answer in both ways. You can talk about your job or you can talk about the activities you do in your job. For example, let's see. Irma, good morning. <laughs> All right. So Irma, what do you do? I am assistant aduanal, ¿cómo se dice? A custom assistant. Custom I assistant. Am, I am a custom assistant. Amazing. All right, excellent. Uh, Maria, what do you do? <laughs> it's the same here, my customer's office. Oh, I see. All right, interesting. Um, Ana Luisa, tell me, what do you do? I, I am an assistant resources human. Okay. Oh, human, resource. human resources assistant. One more time. Okay. Repeat it, Ana Luisa. I am a human resource, um, I mean, human resources. I am a human resources assistant. There you go. Excellent. Thank you. All right. So just to give you an example. So let's see. Um, Mr. Riz Humberto, are you there? Sí, dime. Oh, nice Spanish. <laughs> ah, pero, perdón. Yes. <laughs> All right, excellent. So tell me, what do you do? What do you do? We're in Mr. Tate. Ah, atrapado. All right, so good. Let's say this one. Huh, people? How can I explain this one? What's the meaning of what do you do? ¿A qué te dedicas? Ajá, Mr. Luis Humberto. Atrapamos. Ah, pensé que, right, so. que seguir con el diálogo. No, sí. <laughs> yes. 
So what's, what's your profession or what's your job about? Are you, for example, a doctor, a nurse? Uh -huh. Okay, I am a developer. All right, excellent. Thank you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We'll be asking you more questions later, All right? <laughs> so let's see. Carla, what do you do? I am a credit executive. A credit executive. So Carlita gives money to people. People pay attention to me. All right. So, all right. So let's do this one. Thank you. We can continue with the conversation here. All right. So it says then, nice, nice meet, nice to meet you. I'm in charge of the kitchen staff. Great. Oh, Mr. Jung, what does the girl over there do? All right. So we have another example here, which is super important. All right, is this one right here? What does the girl over there do? All right, so who can translate that question for me, please? ¿Qué hace la chica? ¿Qué hace la chica ahí? ¿Qué hace esa chica, esa chica de ahí? All right, so very good. Uh, for example, this is something that we know as the third person in simple present, right? So we are not going to talk about uh, us, like personally speaking, but we are going to talk about um, another person. So for example, let's see. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Carla, Carla Milena. Mm, Carla Milena, turn the camera off people. Ah, oh, hey, she's back. Hello, hello. Se me apagó el teléfono, perdón. <laughs> Coincidence. You know, that reminds me of Irma yesterday. All right, so let's see. Tell me, uh, do you remember what does Luis Humberto do? Mm? No, teacher. <laughs> do you remember what does Maria do? No, solo me acuerdo nada más de... Ah, sí, dijo que era lo mismo que, que Irma. Dijo yeah. que era asistente. <laughs> no me acuerdo lo demás, pero dijo que era asistente. No sé si era atención al cliente. All right, excellent. Mm -hmm. Nancy, I saw you raise your hand. Do you have any question or want to participate? Um, no, 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 no. <laughs> no, I don't have a question. Ah, uh, so no, era, eh, a I, I remember... Eh, ¿A qué se dedicaba? Luis. Luis. ¿Qué es eso? Developer. Es <laughs> a developer, exacto. All right. So, what you need to actually hear, uh, to pay attention to, it's like the type of questions we ask. For example, uh, look at the chat. If I'm talking about you, for example, I will say, what do you do? So, I'm asking the question directly to you. I'm talking to the person, right? But if I want to ask for somebody else, si quiero preguntar por alguien más, all right, you say he or she, I'm going to say, what does he or she do? Like that one, all right? So for example, um, how would you ask in English, a qué se dedica Maria? How do you say that in English? A qué se dedica Maria? What does Maria do? Exactly. That is correct. All right. How do you say, a qué se dedica William? Hello. Supervisor. <laughs> Thank you. But how do you say in English the question? A qué se dedica? What does William do? Perfect. Thank you, Anna. That was actually good. All right. And pay attention to the next question. How do you say, a qué se dedican Maria y Carla? Where, where? What do Maria and Carla do? Exactly. Oh my God, Anna, that was super good. All right. Why not thus? Estamos hablando de María y de Carla, que son ellas, but eh, ahora es plural. Y para el plural, we are going to use where? do. No, where, no, porque where es donde. All right, so, no, si no. con what. What, 
Por aquí seguimos con el do. What do Maria and Carla do? So we let's go like this one. What do Maria and Carla do? Who can tell me why? ¿Quién me puede decir por qué? Who can tell me why? Uh -huh. Ana Elizabeth, the microphone. Porque el pronombre sería. Uh -huh. Es ellos, ellas. Ellos, no, no, no. ellas en este caso. That is correct. Okay. All right. Hey, that's actually super good. All right. So let's just continue with this um, conversation right here. It says she's Nisa. She's in charge of purchases. Uh -huh, people, what is purchases? Vocabulary, vocabulary. What is purchase? Or purchases. Compras. 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 Thank you, Alexa and Anna. All right. That was good. All right, so and now we are going to uh, practice this dialogue right here. All right, excellent. Aquí está la lista. Perfect. So we're going to check it right now before we go to the break room, break up rooms and practice them. All right, give me one second here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see. E -e -e -e. Thursday, here it is. Abner Adoni Molina Hernández. Abner Abner. Uh -huh. Abner participating. Oh, it's there. All right. Thank you, Abner. Okay, so let's see. One. All right, Alexa Marcela Cibrián. Present. Thank you. Ana Elizabeth Melendez. Present. Thank you. Uh, Ana Luisa Espinosa. Present, teacher. Thank you. All right. So, Andrew, Andre Pardo. Present, teacher. And uh, Mr. Pardo, I'm sorry. Can you tell me again how do you pronounce your name so I can, I don't want to make mistakes. No, all right, later. <laughs> all right. Yes, teacher. How is it? Podría repetirme? Of course. Can you tell me how to pronounce your name again? Andre. Andre. Thank you. Thank you. I will memorize it. Thank you. Andre. All right. And Neftali Medina. Present teacher. Thank you. David Mugia. I hear teacher. Thank you. Uh, Erling Castro. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. All right, Irma de Jesus. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jose Daniel Castro. Present. Thank you. All right, Jose Francisco. Jose Francisco Ordoñez. What a surprise, Francisco is on here. Me parece escuchar a temprano. All right, let's see. Kevin says present. Okay, let's see here. Carla Mirena Lopez. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, Kevin Cortez is says present through the chat. All right, Luis Humberto Gonzalez. Present teacher. Thank you, sir. All right, so let's see this one. Oh my God, sorry. Who's next? Next is Maria Castro. Present teacher. Sí. Eh, Marta Castillo. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, so Mauricio Ruano. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, Nancy Ochoa. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. All right, so then Oscar Benjibar. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Oscar Humberto Argueta. Present, teacher. Thank you. So Sandra, perdón, Raúl Ramírez. 
Raúl Mauricio Ramírez. No. All right, Sandra Yamilet. Present teacher. Thank you, hello. Hello. Sonia Maribel. Present teacher. Thank you. And William Giovanni Laines. Present. Thank you very much. All right, excellent. So the attendance has been checked. All right, and I will do it again at, at the end of the class. All right, excellent. So, all right, everybody, let me repeat the dialogue one more time. So then you can go to the rooms to practice with a, a partner, all right? It says there, hello, good morning. Are you Mr. John? Yes, I am. I'm Miss Tate. I'm the trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you too. Miss Tate, let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the branch manager and this is Leo. Welcome, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. Mario, nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. I'm in charge of the kitchen stuff. Great. Oh, Mr. John, what does the girl over there do? She is Nisa and she's in charge of purchases. All right. So let's see this one right here. We are going to work in groups right now. So I guess it's group of three, Mr. T, Mr. John, and Mario, Mario and Leo. All right. So group of three to the rooms right now, okay? Remember to participate, people, in the rooms so you can practice your pronunciation, all right? So let's see here. Let's join them. Let's go ahead and practice. Let's go to the rooms, if you can, of course. If you cannot speak, let me know so I can move you to listen to the conversation with other classmates. All right, all right, thank you, thank you. All right, so let's see here. Maria, Maria, go to the room. Oscar, Sandra, go to the room. David, go to the room. No sé qué dice, teacher, pero no puede entrar. Don't worry, Maria, where are you here? Let me see. Go to that one, Maria. All right. That's his name. Perfect. So I will go ahead and check room by room. Let's see. Introduce the child. This is Mario, he, she branch manager, and this is Leo. 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 This yeah. is Leo. Welcome. Nice to meet you too. Nice meeting you. Mario, nice to meet you too, Leo. What do you do? How do you say Leo? Sí, uh -huh. Nice to meet you. I I am in charge of the kitchen staff. Great. Um, Mr. John, what does the girl over there do? She is Nisa. No sé cómo es. She is Nisa. Sí, va. 
She's Miss. She in charge of purchase. 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 A ver cómo diablos. Oh, purchases. 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 Uy, teacher. Este, y la otra palabra. Purchases. Esa, she. she Intro. Eh, ¿Cómo dijo introduce? Introduce. Introduce. Correct. Introduce. Introduce, yes, yes, yes. No, y es el teacher dos. del último párrafo, she needs, she needs. Es que ese es nombre, ¿verdad? Me, me. Yes, yes. Eh, eh, la, 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 la de abbreviation MS. She, she, she is Nisa. Oh, Nisa, yes, el nombre. She is Nisa. She is Nisa. Nos faltan dos participantes y solo vemos dos. Y hay cuatro. No worry, solo son dos líneas de los otros dos. Right, so. Entonces esas dos las va a hacer usted. Ay, no. Bye, bye. Right, so. Practice, practice. I'll be back. All right. If you have questions, okay. I can go ahead with okay. you. It's to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you, Miss Tate. Let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the branch manager, and this is Leo. Welcome, and uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you, L Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. I am chain of the kitchen staff. Great. Um, Mr. John, what does the girl over there do? She's nice. She's in, in chain of for chain. For chain. Purchases. 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 Okay. Purchases, ajá. Purchases. Um, okay. All right. Si gusta, comienza, comienza hoy, Carla. Okay, Carlita. Okay. Hello, good morning. Are you Mr. John? Yes, I am. I am Miss Tate. I am the trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you, Miss Tate. Let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the branch manager and this is Leo. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you. Bye. Purchase. Yeah. Purchase. Nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. I'm in charge of the kitchen staff. Great. Oh, Mr. John, what do do? What do? What does the girl over there, there do? There do. Yes, Nisa. She is in charge of purchase. Purchases. Purchases. Thank you. ¿Cómo? Purchases. 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 Como con una o al principio. Purchases. 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 What does the girl over there? Okay. ¿Por qué los hombres? Uy, ¿qué es eso? 
Estamos watching teacher, those videos. ¿Qué está, ¿qué, está, ¿Qué está viendo, teacher? I don't know, it wasn't me, that was you. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. El teacher está viendo novelas. Con, mire. Controlando el teacher. All right, so let's see. Ready? Ready. Excellent. So let's just continue right now. Let's go back to the main session so we can all participate. All right. I know I'll participate. Mm, but with tears. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Let's continue. Mm, all right, everybody's here. So let's see. I need some volunteers, all right? Oh, Irma told me that she wanted to be a volunteer in the breakup room. All right, so it's going to be Irma and Nancy, right? The first volunteers. Excellent, girls. That's the attitude. Woo, super good, super good. All right. Let me share it right here so you can see it as well on this screen. All right. Pero hay tres personas ahí, teacher. No sé si alguien tal vez nos podría ayudar. All right. Uh -huh. Algún voluntario. Hoy nos. Ahí está. Who is the volunteer? Mr. Ronald, he said he will, he's a volunteer. Ah, ok. Si usted empieza yo entonces. Ok. Y yo soy Mr. John entonces. Uh -huh. Mr. Ronald will be Mario and Leo. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Hello. Good morning. Are you Mr. John? Yes, I am. I'm Mr. Tate. I'm the trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello. Nice to meet you, Miss Tate. Let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the branch manager, and this is Leo. I Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, again. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. Nice I'm in chair of kitchen staff. Great. Oh, Mr. John, what does, what does the, the girl over there? She's Nisa. She's in charge of purchases. Gracias, compañeros. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Super good. Yeah. Super good. You were doing a very good job. I really like the intonation. That was nice, right? So you were doing like, hello, good morning. Are you Mr. John? So that's a nice intonation. So super good, girls. You were doing a very nice job, okay? So let's see, other volunteers? Another volunteer here? Who is it? Come on, people. Volunteer, volunteer. I don't understand. I don't understand. What do you mean, volunteers? To read the part, to read the dialogue? Ah, okay. Yo puedo hacer uno. Okay, no problem. All right, who's going to help him? Oh, and who? Mauricio Rano. All right, excellent. Okay. Go ahead. Mario y Leo. Uh -huh. So William va a ser Mario y, let's see, María va a ser Leo. Ready. Let's do it. Okay. Hello. Good morning. Are you Mr. Young? Yes, I am. I'm Miss State. I'm trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello. Nice to meet you, Mr. Tate. Did me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the rich 
manager and this is Leo. Welcome, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mario. Nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. I am church of the kitchen staff. Great. Oh, Mr. John, what does girl over there do? She nice. She in charge of the person. All right. Excellent. Applause for everybody who participated. That was super good. Thank you, guys. I liked it. So nice pronunciation, right? By the way, and nice intonation. So you were doing a nice job. Congratulations. All right. So thank you, everybody, for participating. We are going to select one more. One more, one group more, and then we finish with this one. One more, please. Who's going to be the volunteer? Mm -hmm. Volunteers, volunteers. Uh, Alexa, thank you, Alexa. Mi Alexa, we <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> All right, so let's see this one. All right, so it's gonna be Alexa. Who were you working with? Uh, William. Yes, teacher. Oh, with William. All right. So and then now, Carla is going to be Mario, and let's see here. Anybody else? Who can be Leo? Let's see, Anna Elizabeth. Oh, Sonia, that's okay. Sonia, you are going to be Leo. All right, so in uh, Carla Mario. All right, go ahead. Hello, good morning. Are you Mr. John? Yes, I am. I am Mrs. Tay, I am the trainer. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you, Miss Tay. Let me introduce the staff. This is Mario. He's the bar, he's the branch manager. Is this Leo? Welcome, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you, Mario. Nice to meet you, Leo. What do you do? Nice to meet you. I'm in charge of the kitchen staff. Great. Oh, Mr. Young. What does the gear over there do? She's nice. She's nice. She's sure of sculpture. Purchases. Remember. She's nice. She's sure of sculptures. Purchases. Purchases. Excellent. Thank you very much. All right. So thank you. That was super good. I like it. Thank you, everybody. A great applause to you who participated in this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Now let's see what's going to be this one. All right. We have this one right here. Let's see if you can actually help me to participate. All right. Let's see. Let's see. We are going to complete the questions based on the information that we were reading before. Let's see. What is going to be here, the, the word that is missing to complete the question, people? Mm -hmm. What is it? What does Mario do? Yes, what does Mario do? Excellent. Do you remember what was Mario's job? Ah, en el diálogo, ¿cuál era el trabajo de Mario? Branch. The branch manager. The branch manager. Vamos a ver. It says right here. Mario, it says. Mm -hmm. The branch manager. Here it is. You see this one? The branch manager. So that answer is correct. So. He is the branch manager, right? So let's put it here. This is like he is the branch manager. There you go, excellent. Thank you. Uh -huh. What about this one? What would be the correct answer for this one? What do you do, Leo? 
Exactly. ¿Por qué no sería como el anterior? What does you do, for example? Porque le está preguntando directamente a él. Creo. Exactly. Right. So in this one, it will be all the colors. All right. This one. What do you do? Exactly. Like that. All right. And what was Leo's job? The kitchen staff. Kitchen staff. Kitchen staff. Let's see this one. It says right here. Ah, mira, aquí la respuesta es this one, pero sería I am in charge o cómo sería ahí? I am in charge. Are you sure? What do you do, Leo? Is the branch manager now this one right here? Sería I am yes, in charge. Sir. All right, excellent. Oops. Okay, let's see what happens. Ah, all right, excellent, thank you. And this one, what is it, people? What does Nita do? Very good, what does? Nisa do is similar to the previous one, to number one. Uh -huh. And she was in charge of esa palabra difícil. ¿Cuál era? Purchase. Purchases. Exactly. All right. So that will be like she is in charge of purchases. There you go. Exactly. Thank you very much. So you were doing a good job on this one. Questions about this activity? No questions? All right. No problem. So we can continue right now with the next activity here. All right. So it's going to be this one. So we are going to learn more vocabulary right now. So let me clean this one second. Here it is. Okay, excellent. So now, people, we are going to review two words, two important words right here. Personal and staff, which is this one that we have right here. We have this one, personal and staff. Those are the two words that we are going to review tonight. It says here that we use personal with plural verbs. So, for example, all personal are trained to provide first aid. That's an example. The second example says, the personnel at the plant are certified. All right, so in this case right here, right? Recuerda, do you remember que era personnel? Personal. El personal, super good. Y ahora, ¿qué será staff? También es como personal, pero ahí veo que dice que se puede utilizar para singular y también para verbos plurales. That is correct. Thank you. And very good observation, Nancy. All right. La palabra personal significa personal, es decir, las personas que trabajan en una compañía. All right. So, al igual que la palabra staff, right? La diferencia en el uso is that the word personal solo se puede usar eh, con verbo en plural. Por ejemplo, si yo quiero decir de personal, tengo que decir are, porque esta se refiere a un plural. All right, so, like the ones you see here. For example, todo el personal están eh, entrenados para proporcionar primeros auxilios. El personal en la planta están certificados. All right, so that's actually what it says right here. Ahora, con la palabra staff, también significa personal en el mismo sentido, talking about the people in a company. All right, but this one puede ser singular o plural, no problem, all right? The staff work, que sería para plural, or the staff works, que sería para singular, all right? So, recuerden, no es que me haya equivocado aquí en decir que esta es singular, sino que tenemos que aplicar la regla de la third person en simple present, que a los verbos, cuando hablamos de eh, tercera persona, se le agrega una S. Do you know the rule? ¿Sabían esa regla? Yes or no? Hello? Yes. No. 
Yes? No. Ok, let me explain it to you quickly here. All right? So, en simple present tenemos una regla que se llama pluralizar los verbos. ¿A qué se llama pluralizar los verbos? Agregarle prácticamente una S o ES, dependiendo del verbo, cuando se hable de he, she, or it. He, she, or it son la third person. Ok. In simple present. En la third person, in simple present, es la que lleva los, la S en los verbos. En este caso, si yo quiero decir, por ejemplo, yo juego fútbol, sería I play soccer. Yo juego fútbol. I play soccer. Like that one. Pero si yo quiero decir, él juega fútbol aplicando la regla de la third person, donde debo agregarle la S, where I have to add the S, al verbo sería he plays soccer. You see? Sería entonces acá, él juega fútbol. Like that. So, ¿Ven la diferencia en los ambos ejemplos? Do you see a difference in the examples? All right. Si yo hablo de primera persona, que sería yo, no hay eh, S en el final del verbo. Esto pasa también con los plurales. All right. No hay S en el verbo. Pero la tercera persona, el simple present, he, she, or it, si lleva esa S en los verbos. Entonces acá, cuando nos dice que la palabra staff can be singular or plural, se refiere a que puede utilizarse como si fuera plural, es decir, sin la S en los verbos o como la tercera persona que sería works. Right? Y ambos casos está bien. Por ejemplo, aquí dice el staff trabaja 40 horas o el staff trabajan 40 horas. All right? So, trabajan, trabaja. All right? So, that's what it means right here. Questions? Hello, people. Questions, questions. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. No questions. Eh, eh, hay unos que se los agrega IES. That is correct. De ahí depende de cómo se escriba el, el verbo, right? So, normally, when hay ciertas letras donde termina, por ejemplo, con la letra O. All right, so donde damos la ES, la ES. For example, si tenemos el verbo go, que significa ir, ahí viene goes. For example, do, does. All right, so those are examples of those verbs like that. Questions, questions? Yes, yes, yes. No questions? Bueno, if you don't have questions for me, I have questions for you. And let's do a pequeño test right now. Third person, simple present test. There you go. So let's see here. Take a look. One sec. It says right here. Okay, okay. So let's see this one that we have right here. All right. Let me share the new screen so you can see it. Do you see the new screen, people? Yes? Yes. Yes. Great. Excellent. Let me make it bigger here. All right. So you see this one right here. This is just for you to try to understand what I'm saying with the S, all right? So el verbo aquí sería sing. What's the meaning of sing? Sing, sing, sing. Cantar. Cantar, excellent. Thank you very much, all right? So aquí dice, ¿qué dice acá? Yo canto. Very good. But if I want to say she, ella canta, sería she? Things. 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 Exactly. So I'm going to add the S. All right. So like that. ¿Qué pasaría acá, por ejemplo, si yo no tuviera eh, this one right here? No tuviera este acá. Y en su lugar, yo tuviera un, for example, let's see, we. Oh, sorry. Un we. Ajá. 
¿Estaría siguiendo, eh, seguir siendo correcto? We sings or no? No, no. no. ¿Y qué hacemos? Quitar la S. There you go. Porque la S solo se agrega con. She, 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 it. She, she, it, or oh, the third person. All right. So, which is the same. So, let's say this one. So, I play. She. Plays. Plays. Very good. All right. So, I read. She. Read. 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 Very good. I go. She. Goes. Goes. All right. So, I ask. She. Asks. 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 Ajá. Luego tenemos esos que terminan con Y. Right. Ahí vamos a eliminar. Es. So we're going to eliminate this one right here. Curious. Exactly. Curious. All right. And we are going to say this one. We are going to use I E S. Exactly. Curious. Enjoy. Enjoyes. 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 No, right. Enjoyes. 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 Right. Thank you. There you go. Excellent. So, uh, wash. Wash. Washes. Wash. 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 Vamos a ver cuánto me sacamos. Nos sacamos 10, guys. We got 10. All right. So, that is correct. So, you guys know how to use this one. Questions? No? All right. No. So, we can continue with this one here. All right. So, if you have questions, so we can continue with. The next activity here. All right, so now it's actually time to use information questions. All right, everybody, please repeat it with me. How to use information questions in simple present. Repeat it, please. How to use How information, to information questions in question question simple present. present. Thank you. It says, look at the words in bold. Ah, guys, what's the meaning of balls? Hello, hello. What's the meaning of balls? Es como la negrita o negrita. That is correct, negrita, all right? A las dos de las letras, all right? Como la esta, esta o esta, all right? So we talk about that. And it says right here, look at the words in bold and complete the statements in the box. All right. So what statements you might say? What text statements you have here? So take a look to this one and we will see what's going on right here. So it says, what do you do? All right. What department do you supervise? What branch does she manage? Where does your company manufacture? What unit do you oversee and what do you report to? All right. So then what are you going to do with this one? Esas son information questions para preguntar um, espe información específica. All right. So for example, ¿qué vamos a hacer con esas right here? Vamos a trabajarlas en um, how to answer those questions. So for example, it says right here. All right. What do you do if you ask this one? Veamos, ¿qué me hace la primera pregunta? Who can ask me the questions? What do you do? All right, so say my, I am a teacher. Great, excellent. All right, so si me preguntaras eso a mí, for example, all right? So if you want to ask that, for example, to, let me ask this. Hello, Anna Elizabeth, what do you do? I am uh, an accountant. I am an accountant. Yes. Teacher, una consulta. Tell me. Eh, para responder, no sería también I do. No. Uh -huh. No, en este caso, no, mi amigo. Porque no es una pregunta de sí o no. You know? Sino que es una pregunta con información específica. ¿A qué me refiero? So, for example, si la pregunta fuera... Do you like 
pizza. Más o menos así, mira. Do you like pizza? La respuesta acá es sí. posiblemente dos. Sí o no. Aquí tú tienes que contestar. Yes, I do. O I don't. Right? don't. Pero porque es una pregunta para responder sí o no. Yes or not. Pero en este caso me están preguntando a qué me dedico. Yes. Entonces la respuesta sí. porque no es de saber decir sí o no. En este caso utilizo el verbo to be, que sería I am, y luego mi trabajo, right? So, como Ana dijo, I am an accountant, o como le dije yo anteriormente, I am a teacher. I am an accountant. Understand, William? Okay, thanks. You're welcome. All right. Excellent. Thank you. This one right here. All right. Let's continue with Ana. Vamos a entrevistar a Ana hoy. All right. And so let's see. What department do you supervise? Mm, department of accounting. Sí, accounting. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Yeah. La contadora es un yeah. departamento de contabilidad. What branch does she manage? Yeah. All right, excellent. So, maneja alguna una sucursal? Yes, I am branch. Ah, Anita, uh, ¿qué estoy a cargo de? In charge. Uh -huh. I am in, I am in charge, charge of branch. A branch. Or la sucursal. Branch Santa Ana. Of Santa Ana. Branch. Branch. All right. Excellent, excellent. There you go. So, where does your company manufacture? All right. So, ¿qué es manufacture? Manufactura. Manufactura o fabricar, right? So, yes. So, you can say, Anita, I understand you said that you work in for a school, right? Yes. Entonces, ahí no se manufactura o no se fabrica nada. ¿Cómo diríamos? Uh -huh. en mi compañía no manufactura. Yo trabajo en un colegio. My company, my company is, is not. My company does not. Does not, does not, not manufacture. manufacture. It is a school. So like this one. Understand? All right. So it says this one. What unit do you oversee? What is oversee people? Finance. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, what is like oversee? Supervisar. Supervise, exactly. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ana, do you supervise any area? Uh, mm, the area Santa Ana. No, but like area like. Mm -hmm. also, mm -hmm. yeah. Sí, human resources area or uh, academic uh, area. No. No? No. Is this one? No, I, no. I don't supervise an area, any any unit. Uh, any area. Yeah. All right, excellent. Who do you report to? What's the meaning of who do you report to, people? Do you remember it? ¿A quién le reportas? ¿A quién le reportas? Exactly, right? A the uh, general accountant. I report to the general accountant. There you go. Excellent. So, 
Yeah, examples. How can you change those? I mean, how can you answer those questions? All right. So just for you to have this one, let me help you with this. Vamos a revisar in like a little bit of Spanish para que quede super clear con todos aquí. First question, dice, what is that's the first question, people? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué haces? Mm, no ¿Qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? Very good. Y ahí Anita contestó que ella es... Una contadora. Una contadora. Uh -huh. Very good. Second question. It says, what department do you supervise? How do you say that in Spanish? ¿Qué departamento supervisas? Exactly. Él dijo que supervisa. El departamento de contabilidad. Very good. Excellent. So, then number three says, what branch does she manage? O sea, ¿qué, ¿de qué sucursal está a cargo? She said. Ella dijo, de Santa Ana. Ajá, de la sucursal de Santa Ana, right? Le preguntamos si su compañía eh, fabrica, right? Y ella dijo que su compañía no fabrica. No fabrica. No, una es escuela. Una escuela. Una escuela. Un colegio o escuela. All right, so then, what unit do you oversee? Le preguntamos qué hay. ¿Qué área supervisa? ¿Qué área o qué unidad supervisa? Y ella dice que... No supervisa. She doesn't ninguna. supervise ninguna any unit. Unidad. Ninguna área. All right. Y aquí, la última question dice, who do you report to? Esa es... ¿A quién reporta? ¿A quién, a quién reporta? Y ella dijo que le reporta al... Gerente... Contador general. Contador, contador general. general. Exactly, thank you, very good. Hicimos eso así para que, like, it, it was clear, ¿verdad? Que no quedara ninguna duda de qué estábamos hablando ahí. Very good. Thank you, Ana, for the information. All right. Okay. Do we have any other volunteer? Otro volunteer para hacerle esta entrevista ahorita? Uh -huh. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, hello. Excellent, Mr. Andre. All right, so let's start right now. Let me just clear all the answers so we can start again. Okay, excellent. So, Mr. Pardo, tell me, what do you do? I am aircraft technician. I am a? Aircraft technician. Oh, aircraft technician. All right, excellent. So, I'm going to review it here. I, I, an aircraft technician. Very good. So, what department do you supervise? Uh, I don't supervise department. All right. So, I don't supervise department. Mr. Pardo dijo, I don't supervise department. Que sería como, yo no superviso departamento. Como sería, yo no superviso ningún departamento. That's correct. Uh -huh. Supervise any department. Any department. Thank you very much. Uh, Mr. Pardo, what branch does she, the, the, do you manage? Mm. Do you remember that question, Mr.? Mm, no, teacher. All right. Can someone help me to translate the question for him? One branch. Uh huh. ¿Qué significaba la question number three, people? Exactly, all right. Mr. Puerto, do you manage any, any branch? No, teacher. All right. I don't, I don't, I don't branch, yeah. I don't branch. I don't. Okay, Mr. ¿Cuál sería aquí el verbo? Manage or branch? Mm, no, manage. Correct. I don't. Manage. Ninguna sucursal? No, ninguna. All right. ¿Cómo sería eso en English, my friend? Mm. I don't manage any branch. Excellent. All right. Now, does your company manufacture? Su compañía eh, fabrica? Uh, no. My company does not manufacture. My company does not manufacture. Excellent. Thank you. Now, Mr. Pardo, do you, what unit do you oversee? What is oversee? Do you remember, Mr.? 
como, sí, como... Sobre algo no sobrevisto como sobrepuesto mm, kind of like supervise mm. supervisar mm. o sea como que ah ya o sea como qué zona superviso exactly mm. no ninguna <laughs> Ok, que, no problem. So, otro. Say, yo no superviso ningún, eh, ninguna unidad o ninguna área. Yes. Mm, I don't oversee any area. Oversee any area. Excellent. And the last one, who do you report to? What is it? I report uh, supervisor. Okay. I report to the supervisor. Okay, estamos. All right. Thank you, Mr. Pardo, for helping me with those answers. All right. Y vieron, okay. chicos, que para poder responder estas preguntas, no necesariamente tienes que hacer lo que la pregunta, valga la redundancia, pregunte. Right. Si tú no haces eso, puedes responder de manera negativa también. Very good. Let's see. Let's go with one more. One more, and then we finish with this activity. Any volunteer to answer these questions? Mm -hmm. Yes. Hello, hello. No volunteer. Who is it? Okay, so let's see. I'm going to select the volunteer right now. All right, my next volunteer. Ah, my next volunteer will be the last person who shows me. Let me see what I have here. Oh, yes, this one right here. Who tells me you know, in the chat, how do you say this in English? Let me see. Mm -hmm. What is it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Let me just put it here. There you go. Excellent. So you can see it. Mm -hmm. so the chat. What is it? Todos lo usamos, people. This one. What is it? Aquí dice, people. Una, and how do you say that in English? Cryon, Anna Elizabeth, thank you. Yes, I have to say that. All right, cryon, 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 cryon. All right, so let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> All right, Nancy, Maria, Mauricio, William, El Ultimo, Anna Luisa, Anna Luisa, Anna Luisa, Anna Luisa, Anna Luisa, Anna Luisa. Thank you, Anna Luisa. All right, so we'll go with you. Thank you, thank you. All right, let me just delete all the answers and let's start again. You're the last one for this activity, all right? So tell me, Ana Luisa, what do you do? Okay, it's... Uh, I'm going to explain first. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. It's that then it will coincide. I'm the charge of planning. It would be payroll manager. Uh -huh, paper manager. Okay, so I am a payroll manager. Excellent. All right. What department do you supervise? To all uh, staff. And uh, um, I'm here to company the rulers and I'm politics. Policies. Policies. I supervise the staff department. All right, excellent. Thank you. What branch do you manage? Ay, ese se me olvidó en español. Perdón. Ah, ¿Quién me ayuda, people? Who can help her? Sucursal. Tu cursal, thank you. Okay. Eh, es que son varios proyectos. Sería I am charge 
uh, of several construction projects. No sé. That answer is perfect. All right. So I'm in charge of several projects. All right. Perfecto. Se carga de muchos proyectos, right? Uh, where does your company manufacture? All right. Yes, uh, I houses, um, build, buildings, uh, casas y apartamentos, houses and buildings. Houses and buildings, all right? But, all right, we didn't pay attention to something here, people. Oh, my God, all right? This one. Oops, sorry. This one. Oh my God. So we didn't pay attention to the detail before. What is it? Mm -hmm. What is that? Where? It's Donde. Donde. Uh -huh. So we didn't pay attention. Mm. A donde fabrican eso? Así como en la Santa Tecla o... Ajá, places. Ajá. Ah, que sería en Santa Tecla en, y en San Francisco. Santa Tecla en San Francisco. San Francisco, California. No, en la colonia San Francisco. Y right. en la... En, del Puerto de la Libertad. All right. Qué nice el puerto. All right. So, what unit do you oversee? Ay, esta es un... Perdón, esa también se me fue. <laughs> All right, what is Like supervise, uh -huh. eh, En Spanish, please. Ajá. Uh -huh. Supervisar. <laughs> ¿Qué unidad supervisa? Uh -huh. ¿Qué unidad? Mm, no, sería igual a todo el personal. No, like, like the manager, keep it. All right, so I supervise, I oversee, sorry, the whole company. All right, this expression, miren, chicos, miren, guys, this one, the whole is como like completo o entero. Whole company. All right, la próxima vez que vayan al supermercado y compren leche. All right, so normalmente las leches que vienen en cartoncitos. All right, so eh, como la tipo Lala o la eh, Zula, los dos types of leches. Tienen una versión en English y una versión en Spanish. Donde dice leche entera, leche descremada, semidescremada, etc. All right, so entonces ahí ustedes van a ver esta palabra también. Whole, all right, que significa entero o completo. All right, there we go. So says, and the last one, who do you report to? Uh, an administration manager. All right. I report to the administration manager. Excellent. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Super good. Thank you. Thank you to the three people who uh, participated with me, Anna. Uh, well, the two Anas, actually. All right, and Mr. Pardo. Thank you. All right, questions about vocabulary, people? No questions? There you go. Excellent. Oops. So let's just continue with the next activity here. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so take a look at this one right here. Okay. It says, everybody pay attention. It says right here, write the questions that correspond to the answers that follow. Use the verbs in parentheses. So, compare your answers with a partner. ¿Qué dice aquí? What are we going to do? Vamos a hacerlo super easy. Mira, tenemos unos verbos acá. Revisemos estos verbos primero antes de go with this one. All right, everybody. Manage. 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 What is the meaning of manage, people? Gerente. 
Mm -hmm. That would be the manager. Pero como verbo. Administrar. Administrar. Thank you very much. All right. So we go like with the verb manage. All right. So it says right here. Luego tenemos here. Um, what is it here? One Super second. Fun. All right. So we have here. Supervise. Everybody. Supervise. Super All right, excellent. So, or, que también tenemos, que significa prácticamente lo mismo, that would be? Oversee. Oversee. All right. ¿Cuál sería como la diferencia entre oversee and supervise? Uh -huh. Supervise. Supervisor. Uh -huh. Oversee. Supervisar. All right, over C, all right. Si ustedes se van al traductor o al translator y le ponen ahí la palabra over C, les va a tirar también supervise. So that's basically like a synonym, all right. So then you go on this one, a report to. What is report to? Reportar a. Reportar a, all right. Excellent. So let's go on this one right here. In manufacture. Fabricar. 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 Very good. And do? Hacer. 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 Exactly. All right. And what are we going to do? Pongamos atención a este example que, tenga, que tenías aquí. Aquí, you know, very simple. Ya teníamos una respuesta que era esta. That we have right here. It says right here, eh, Marta manages the sales department. Como puedes ver, en todas las demás tenemos solamente la respuesta. Entonces tenemos que crear la pregunta. Para esta respuesta, creamos acá esta pregunta. So we go on this one. What department does Marta manage? Porque la respuesta era, Marta manages the sales department. Let me help you with the next one. Let's see. For this one, it says, I supervise the maintenance department. ¿Cuál sería la pregunta, people? What? 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 Department. 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 Dos. Do. Do. Dos or do. Do. Mm -hmm. Do. 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 Mm -hmm. first, first person. Do you? Exactly. Correct. Do you? Supervise. Supervise. All right, in the question mark. All right. So what department do you supervise? Y luego dice acá, I supervise the maintenance department. So yes or no, people? Yes. Yes. Excellent, thank you. All right, so let's continue with the next one right here. Eh, la respuesta nos dice acá. Claudio oversees the branch in Ilopango. All right, so what, what is it here? What branch mm -hmm. does Claudio Claudio oversee. oversee exactly? Thank you very much. So you can see this one right here, and then you go on the next one. So it says here. Our next answer is this one. The assemblers report to the supervisor. Uh huh. What's the question, people? Vamos a ver. Hoy no me la digan. Escríbanla en el chat. All right. Please send it to the chat. Send it to the chat. Send it to the chat. What's the answer? What's the answer? Let's see. What do you report? What do you report? Mm -mm. No. 
Who do you report to? Yes. Because it's a person. Who? A quien? Mm -hmm. All right. Excellent. Empty era. Ah, yes. All right. So let's see. Who do you report to? Exactly. Thank you. There you go. Who do you report to, Nancy? Thank you very much. All right. So I can see this one right here. So it will be this one. Who do you report to? Exactly. I report to the supervisor. Thank you. All right. And then we got this one. We manufacture in the Santa Ana plant. All right. So nosotros fabricamos en la, en la planta de Santa Ana. What is the question? Where does your company? Uh -huh. Where does your company? Manufacture. Manufacture. All right, excellent, thank you. Uh -huh. And the last one, it says right here, do what do you trains the new stuff? Uh -huh. eh, Sáqueme de una duda, teacher. Ahí para nosotros se utiliza el does, no es do. All right, eh, en este caso, uh -huh. eh, porque estamos hablando de tu compañía, estamos uh -huh. hablando como que fuera eso. You know, en este caso de aquí, mira, le explico. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you see this? Yes. Va, good. Ahí dice tu compañía. Entonces, la pregunta dice, ¿dónde tu compañía fabrica? Mm -hmm. El sujeto es tu compañía. El sujeto es. Mm, persona, es eh, de cosa, de... ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Es okay. Cosa. Thank you. Sí, thank you. You're welcome. All right. Y la pregunta, ellos le responden diciendo nosotros, you know, fabricamos en la planta de Santa Ana, which is a different thing. All right. Good. Excellent. Thank you for that question. All right. Uh, the last question says, do glass trains the new stuff? Y nuestro verbo es do. So what are we going to do here? What do you what do? Does do, do? Do or does? What does do? What does do glass do? do. That's it. And you go on this one right here. All right. What does Douglas do? And we are going to say Douglas trains the new stuff. Thank you. All right. Any other question, people, that you might have? Questions about vocabulary or structure or anything else? No? Yes or no? Mm -hmm. Okay, no. no questions? No problem. So let's see here, people. We are going to now work on the last activity for tonight. And it's this one you have right here, all right? It says right here, role play. A two minute conversation introducing yourself and a staff to someone else at the business event seminar, training, or product presentation. Take turns asking and answering questions like the ones in the model conversation. So, ¿qué les toca hacer ustedes ahora? Hacer una conversación parecida a la que practicamos hace unos minutos, o sea, a esta. All right, so, you know, una conversación que sea como esta, donde diga, hello, for example, digamos que trabajan Eh, Ana Luisa e Irma. All right. So, hello, Irma. Good morning. How are you? Good. Thank you. Excellent. I am eh, Ana Luisa and I am the trainer. Nice to meet you. ¿Y qué hace Mauricio? Ah, Mauricio está encargado de contabilidad. Oh, excelente. ¿Y qué hace Fulanita? Fulanita está encargada de el staff. You know, una conversación así. All right. So, remember, super important here. La conversación será entre dos personas. Y en estas dos personas, usted va a preguntar acerca de otras personas. All right. So, for example, let's see. Veamos. Um, Nancy. Hello, Nancy. Hello. All right. Excellent. Imagine that you and I have a conversation. All right. 
So, hi, good evening, Nancy. Excuse me. Hi, good evening. How are you? All right. I'm I'm good. I'm JJ and I am the manager. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. All right. Y usted me dice que es usted de una sola vez. Mm, what do you do? No, usted, ¿qué es? ¿Qué hace? Y vete a algo. Ah, de algo. Ah, ok, 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 ok. I am... I am a domain analytical analyst. Oh, ok. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Y yo le voy a preguntar ahora que, qué hace otra persona inventada. For example, eh, ok, Nancy, and what does Ana do? Uh, Ana... Ana does the um, Ana does to prepare the report. All right. So the Ana prepares the reports. Okay. All right. Because... Excellent. Y así vamos a ir con la conversation preguntándole por dos o tres compañeros cuando mucho. All right. Yes. Excellent. Yes. So let's just continue here and let's go to the breakout room so we can actually uh, do it again. All right. Let's go to the rooms, people. Teacher, I'm busy. No puedo conectar ahorita. Excuse me? Estoy ocupado ahorita. No puedo conectar a la sala. All right, no problem. So you can stay maybe just listening, all right? Yes. All right, no problem. Okay. Alexa, Oscar, David, Sandra. Sorry, teacher. Eh, yo soy Mario. Excuse me? Es que yo perdí un poquito el contacto. Ah, all right. So, eh, ¿se van a unir al room o no pueden ahorita? Ok, sí, ahorita sí, teacher. All right, excellent. Hay teacher Ajá. conduciendo Ajá. a la casa. Eh, welcome, nice to meet you. All right. Bueno, ¿qué pasó aquí, Sandra? What happens? Conduciéndole, le comentaba. Oh, ok, I'm sorry, sorry. All right. Sí, sí, sí. Ok, um, Alexa, eh, I'm going to send you to another room. Le voy a mandar a un room donde hay alguien esperando. All right. Ok, teacher. Go ahead. Hello, hello. Do you need help? Hello. Do you need help? Questions, vocabulary, expressions? No. All right. No problem. So remember, if you need help, just call me. I'll be back. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Gracias. Bye. Mm -hmm. Yes. And then I welcome nice Nancy or nice Nancy who said welcome, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you, Anna. Uh, nice to meet you, Marta. What do you do? Um I am a accountant. Accountant. Um mm -hmm. nice to meet you. I am in charge of the yeah, I am. Ahí le puedo decir lo que hago, ¿verdad? Ajá, pero sería. I am. Um, 
I am a general post office. No, general manager for post office. Okay. Eh, is there a young uh, department of content? No, quizás ahí sería, usted dice, great. Uh, miss, um, Mr. Ah, Martin, perdón. what does she, she do? Uh, she overdo, what does she do? Okay. Ajá, recuerda que estamos great. usando Marta. Mm -hmm. What does it, uh, the sheer they do? Y como escribanlo en el chat porque no, no entiendo esa parte. Mm -hmm. I am what? Ahorita. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, questions? Mm, no, por el, solo tenemos que tener una conversación donde preguntemos qué es lo que hacemos, ¿verdad? Entre nosotros dos. Lo que hacen o le pueden preguntar a su compañero por lo que hace alguien más, ¿you know? Okay. Sí. Ok. Está bien, está bien. Okay. Y a mi nota. ¿Ah? Y a mi nota. <risa> ah, es huevo batido. <risa> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hello, people. You finish here. Hello, hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. Con un pequeño problema por acá, por ahí que está muy bien. Está conectado. All right. All right. Hello, teacher. No problem. I will check other rooms, all right? Don't worry. No. <laughs> yeah. Remember, he's in charge. ¿Cómo? In charge. Sí, Roberto está a cargo de la bodega. Is in charge of the uh, water house. Water house. Celia, uh -huh. yes, Robert is in charge of water house. Oh my God, siempre ven el phone aquí en este group. Uh -huh. <laughs> No, nadie tiene teléfono. Uh -huh. Suspicious. Mismo room. <risa> <risa> no. No, 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 no. Siempre que entra el teacher se escucha ese ruido antes, ¿verdad, Irma? Que estábamos solitas y no escuchamos nada. Sí, yo creo que él lo tiene. <risa> no. Oh, my goodness. Ay, no way. Él. No All right. Yo creo que se le olvida ponerlo. Ajá. Ahí. Viendo TikTok estaba. <risa> no, era una TikTok. Ok. Ya me olvidó. Está Era encargado de, de, de la. Roberto es encargado de bodega. Ajá. Uh -huh. Luego, ¿qué más vamos a preguntar? Mm -hmm. 
Vaya, utilicemos la pregunta del what does the what does uh, ah, sí, va. what does Kevin over there do? ¿Qué hace Kevin ahí? La voy a escribir. Ok. Uh -huh. Ahí bueno. estaríamos metiendo a otra persona. No, siempre Kevin. Ah, es que era Roberto, ¿verdad? No, Roberto, no. <risa> <risa> es Roberto. <risa> no, a ver, ¿por qué se acordó de Kevin? <risa> Me acordé de Kevin, no sé. Es que creo que lo que estoy leyendo aquí, no, no, pues no, no sé por qué me acordé de Kevin, del nombre Kevin. Algo pasa. No sé, quizás es el nombre que, que, que había pensado desde un principio y luego nos decidimos por Roberto, creo que eso pasó. Sí. Guardas Roberto over there do. Del, over there do. Over there do. Uh -huh. Ahí. ¿Qué hace Roberto ahí? Correct. Okay, time's up, girls. I will be uh, sending everybody back to the main room, all right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, copiemos Irma esto. Nos lo llevamos antes de que nos vayamos. Sí, porque ella nos va a preguntar. Y yes. <laughs> Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, everybody. Hello, hello, thank you. All right, excellent. So let's see, do I have a volunteer? No volunteers. Mauricio Antonio Rano, excellent. Mauricio, who were you working with? Okay. Hello, Luis. How are you? Hello, Mauricio. What a surprise. Uh, how do, how was your day? My day is good. I work in the American power manufacturing in the shore. By the way, where is your friend working? Okay, Ponky is actually working on Los Catalana as an assistant accountant. Uh, actually, he helped to another uh, accountant to all the accounting department and calculate in taxes and Pay invoices, paying invoices, I think. Okay, Luis. Good guy, happy day. Hey, that was an amazing conversation. Bye. Bye. All right, excellent. Super nice, guys. Nice creativity, a nice structure used in the conversation. I like that. So that was super good. Good job. Good job. Good job. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so let's see. Any other volunteer? La última pareja, and then we go to sleep. All right, so, uh -huh. Hello, hello. Who's going to be my last volunteer? Come on, people, volunteer. El último y nos vamos. The last one, and we go home. <laughs> Hello. Bueno, como Mauricio pasó voluntariamente, 
he's going to select the next person. Good. Maria Epifania? Hello, Maria. <laughs> hey, Maria, who are you working with, Maria? Ana Luisa. Ah, that's why Ana Luisa was like, oh my God, all right? <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> All right, excellent. So go ahead, girls. Continue, we're going to finish with you. Good, okay. hello, good morning. Are you Ana Luisa? Eh, perdón. Uh, I am, yes, I am. Per, uh, perdón, yes, I am uh, assistant, no, perdón, I you human resource assistant. Uh, I am uh, Maria, uh, I am um, warehouse manager and nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you too. Uh, what do you do? I am custom office manager. Okay, welcome. Uh, Marta, so, yeah, she, what, perdón, what does uh, Marta do? Uh, Marta is a general manager for the company. Okay, hasta ahí, teacher. All right, excellent. So don't worry, you were doing a very good job. All right, so thank you. I like the creativity, right? In the hecho, los felicito. I congratulate you because you were uh, following the structure, the vocabulary, and the idea from the previous conversation. Quiere decir que you guys understood exactly what was that about. Thank you very much. All right. So let's see here, ladies and gentlemen. So we are going to continue with this one right here. All right. So solamente me ayudan una vez más aquí. Voy a sacar el... Um, la asistencia de los conectados hasta este momento para la última asistencia, pero before you go home, I want you to help me to answer uh, this, all right? Como todas las noches, para hacer nuestro self-assessment, all right? So remember, so you work like independently with occasional help or only with help here, all right? So send these reactions, please, through the chat. What's the reaction so I can see that from your side? Now I can ask and answer information questions about personal in their position, right? Ahora puedo hacer preguntas acerca de el personal y su posición. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> Luis Humberto, that's not an option. All right, so <laughs> let's see. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Oh my God. All right, excellent. Thank you, thank you for confirming people, right? So, como todas las noches les digo, every night I tell you, right? So, si ustedes tienen preguntas, dudas, inquietudes, por favor, utilicemos el grupo de WhatsApp que tenemos para evacuar nuestras dudas. Y yo con mucho gusto, eh, como ustedes se han dado cuenta anteriormente, los puedo eh, ayudar con sus dudas. And if you need more vocabulary or anything else, por favor, escríbeme en el grupo, right? So, una vez lo tenga ahí, yo le voy dando seguimiento. All right? Excellent. So, well, we're going to stop right here. Thank you very much. All right? Have a good night. And I will see you tomorrow. Have a nice day, a nice rest of your day. A good night. All right? So, bye-bye. Bye bye, teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Have a good night.